Shopping, entertainment, living. There are plans for all that and more in one area of St. Louis County. But multiple people say those plans are too risky. The development zone is proposed in Maryland Heights. It would surround Creefcore Lake. News 4's Alexis Zotos is live tonight along 141, detailing the concerns floating around the plan. Well, Courtney, you can see behind me, there are signs that say for lease, for sale, all along this section of 141. The other thing that you can also see is the floodwaters that are in the areas where these proposed buildings would go. But that is not stopping the city of Maryland Heights from taking a really hard look at how to develop this entire area in the near future. I want to build something just to show they can do it. That's that's our take on it. Kim Cotterback has been fighting against the city of Maryland Heights his hopes to develop the land surrounding 141 for more than a decade. They want to put as much development as possible there. Right now, a good portion of what the city has designated the Maryland Park Lake District is underwater. For sale signs, advertising opportunities to build are surrounded by floodwaters. That site was completely underwater. All the roads are underwater right now. There have been multiple planned developments that have fallen through over the years, but at a special meeting Thursday, a presentation will be made to the city council for a vision of what to do with the 2000 acre area, a plan that includes entertainment, retail, residential and business, while also preserving the green space. For several concerned citizens, this is just too much for that area. As a human living in this world, I'm shocked and surprised. As someone who's been involved in this for since like 2008, I'm not surprised anymore. The Calls to the mayor and several city council members were not returned today. But a spokesperson for the city says the presentation tomorrow will be the first step in helping the city make the wisest decisions moving forward, including possible changes to infrastructure and stormwater issues. So I did speak with one councilwoman late tonight who says she does have a lot of about this proposal. One of the questions we wanted to have answered today was why this area with clear concerns about flooding? Why is the city set on developing it? They say they are confident in the levy system around this part of Maryland Heights. They also say the proximity of all of this area to 141 makes it a prime destination for development in what they say could be the largest mixed use development in the region. Live in Maryland Heights, Alexis Zotos, News 4.